a football fan's dream come true. But he didn't want to score the winning touchdown. He wanted to make a tackle. You see, Gavin was born with a birth defect. He loves football, but he'll never be able to play the game. As Paul Burton shows us, Gavin has inspired so many people. The two coaches and their teams put their rivalry aside to give Gavin a thrill that he will never forget. One, two, three. Hand over! Eight-year-old Gavin Gill is a natural-born leader. And then you are down. on defense, you guys. He's passionate, determined, and knows how to win a football game. I do score a touchdown, guys. Okay. Gavin has been diagnosed with Prader-Willi syndrome, an extremely rare birth defect in which there's no cure. Cognitive delays. He's slower than a lot of the other kids. Very low muscle tone. So he'd never be able to play an organized sport. He would get hurt. But on Sunday, he lined up with his teammates from the Hanover Youth football team and made the bravest tackle of his career in the final seconds of the game versus Situate. At first, the play was designed for him to score, but Gavin had another play in mind. He kept yelling at Kevin, no, no, I want to tackle, tackle, not, not run, tackle. So the Situate, Kevin said, any of you guys want to be tackled? And the entire team on Situate was raising their hands. And with all his might, Gavin tackled not just one, but two players from Situate. I tackled. Why do you like tackling so much? I so we can have fun. It seems like he loves to tackle. Yeah, I mean, look at him, he's a madman. <laughs> there wasn't a dry eye in the crowd. He's all about defense, and he watches us practice, and he wants to, he's, he's, he is part of the team, and he wanted to make that tackle. Feels great, you know. He stole the show. On this day, both teams walked away winners. You can't explain what it does for us. It's not really about who wins the game. It's truly how you make the person feel. And for Gavin, it means more. I'm telling you, he, he may retire after this game. <laughs> and if he does, he'll always have a career in coaching. No, 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 Jimmy Dickin one had the ball. Start over. And no matter if he tackles or coaches, his teammates will always love him. And Hanover on Paul Burton, WBZ News.